What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Alan. It's your MLB 22 Road to the Show series, if you will. And tonight's series has been sponsored by Next Level Energy. If you guys still do not know what Next Level Energy is, it is basically a life hour energy shot. We are about to hop right into the MLB Road to the Show. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, you guys are having an amazing day whenever you guys are watching this, of course. But like I said, today's series has been sponsored by Next Level Energy. If you guys don't know what that is, it's basically like a five-hour energy shot. So here we go. We're about to take it right here. I forgot how decent this is, but we're about to try it. So there we go. Bada bing, bada boom, boom, Go oh, grab you some tea pain lemonade if you guys are feeling low and leveled out through the day. Go grab you some tea pain lemonade. Next level energy. Everything you know will be up in the description below by using my promo code Alan Landed. I believe you say save, save 15 to 10 percent. I can't remember. We're, but we're gonna hop right into this episode. We got some work to do. What shall we work on? Um, we'll work on a breaking ball, if you will. That was the splitter. Alright, we'll, okay, we'll, we'll work it out. Hopefully it doesn't spec out. Holy shit, 15 to 4. Where did that come from? Fifteen to four. Where did that come from? As you may know, we did take a loss that last episode, but it is what it is. We got bounce back. Although we did get ten strikeouts, so I'm trying to do better with that as well. Here we go. Sit back, relax, and enjoy episode twenty-five. I can't believe we're already on twenty-five episodes of this. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. If you guys are new, hit that subscribe button up on YouTube, youtube.com slash unlanded. Stay tuned for a lot more content coming your way. What's up, chat? If you are new, up on Twitch, twitch.tv slash unlanded. All locations, no spaces as well. You can catch me live here on Twitch. I do read the chat. Feel free to make some friends up on this channel. And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. The show has an AL East matchup. It's the Boston Red Sox taking on the Baltimore Orioles. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Let me know if you guys can hear it okay. We'll check the standings after the game. All right, just about set to go. And towing the slab here, Allen, the kid. Chris, he's got the ability to take control of a game when he's out there. Well, incredible mound presence, and he's going to attack hitters. Look at that strikeout per nine ratio over 10 coming into this start. So he's a pitcher that wants the ball. He's aggressive. He knows that he can get the swing and miss, especially when he needs it most. Leading we'll see how effective he is in this one. So just about set now. So Trevor. stepping in for Boston, Trevor Story. If you guys do follow baseball, who's your favorite baseball team? Leave it in the comments below. Okay, all right, here we go now. There we go. First pitch on the way at Camden Yards. That misses. What? And this one is off and running. Bullshit. I barely missed out. The oh, next dude. offering misses. Are you Two balls, no strikes to count. And he deals. There we go. Oh. That one ripped. Santander makes Santana. the catch. One down. Santander. Batting second. Here's a check of the Red Sox lineup. 
put together by manager Alex, Alex Cora. Verdugo. All right, Singy, how about all the talent in this lineup? They're deep, they first and foremost, count. but the way that they can manipulate their personnel for matchups and everything but, else, it's uh, way back very in intelligent the way that they use their team, and I, I think it creates no a little bit of uh, uncertainty for opposing teams, especially in a big in game, big series. Here's Alex Verdugo. Here we go, guys. Verdugo. Oh, first I thought, off, he, I, I thought he was going to change. No score just getting started. Top of the first. Oh, slider down here. That's Next pitch ball. is downstairs. This offense screwing me tonight. Nine notes. And this is inside. Are you freaking kidding me? We're going right down the middle. Yeah, the right hander deals. That's through there for a strike. Good zip on that fastball at the bottom of the zone. If he's there all day, it's going to be a tough one for the hitters. Ooh, and fouled off. Ooh, that boy, I thought that was gone, man. We're going to win the slider. Swing and a miss, buddy. Thanks for coming. Oh. Foul ball. He stays alive. Ah, 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 ah. Staying alive. Staying alive. We about to get him with the vocal change down below the knees. One down, Here base is empty. Swing and a ball popped up. And it drops in. So a man aboard now with one away. All right. Oh, nice though. Play he needed nice. that one. It's been a tough stretch that at the plate hurt. lately. Just a blue hit behind third right there, and that's a really Over. tough play for a third baseman or shortstop to get to, and the same for the left fielder. So he just found a perfect place to drop one that down, one in one right down. there. And here is Xander Bogarts. And yeah, the first one offering one is play. not close. Plays it too. Let's roll it up now. Oh. Next offering is foul back. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just could catch up. At the belt and fires. Yeah, Swing and a miss. Boy. And a count one and two. I think he was sitting off speed there. One, two now. Stays Ooh. alive. Verdugo leads off first with one away. Yeah, with the cutter outside the corner. And the next and pitch is way outside. Verdugo. Oh, this is a guy that can be frustrating oh, for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at bat. I'm sure there's some times where pitcher would rather just give up a first pitch single than have to waste six or seven pitches on one hitter. The two-two. Round out, baby. Just you, off the inside are you edge. Looking serious? And now filled up. Sit down, my boy. Pitch. Swing and a miss, and he struck Bravo. him out. And there's two down. Carl, he should get some fist bumps when Google. he gets back into the dugout because even that though he strikes out, he saw baseball. a lot of pitches and he Bumpy battled. Out. And yeah. this is a long haul where Ooh, you're trying to get that pitch count up as early as possible. So gave the guys behind him an opportunity to see what's working for this pitcher or not. But I tell you what, it's a nice hey. job right there. Rafael Devers stands in now and lets that one go for a strike. Hey, now we've got two. Whoa. Next offering is foul back. Well, lots of pitches thrown in this first inning, and it's kind of that nightmare scenario Damn, for starting boy. pitching. But you know what? Yeah, it's still that. early enough. He can settle in. He can get some length if he just cleans up his mechanics a little bit. Are you serious? And the 0-2. That's inside. Come on, you should have swallowed that, man. Here we go, guys. They want the bulk of change. Ah, and a swing and a miss. That and that's thing. that. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. I think the key is arm action on the changeup. When Woo. you can sell it like a fastball, you drop the velocity, you get the swing and miss, and you walk off the field. Ah, no boys. Now our boys can score. Now J.D. Martinez hey, at the plate. Hitting Lee better Marshall against right-handers this year. So some reverse splits there. J.D. Martinez. <laughs>
the kid back to work. Both you and I, I know born. how much attention I to detail that J.D. Oh, Martinez pays. Kind of makes me think of Albert Pujols, who has been called the machine at times during his career. I'd venture to say you could put J.D. Oh, Martinez in that same category, at least the way he approaches his craft. If so, where? Um, yes, sir! Even strikes, though he did not he go, but I'll take you anyway. Christian That's Vasquez, good. the hitter, good Perfect. defender. He's been inconsistent <laughs> offensively. First pitch, and that's Ooh, in for a strike. Slider. Hey, one day no I'll score here in the down. second. Yes, Jack Swing sir. went around. Take that any day, baby. Kevin, what the uh, sweeping curve down over there? And that's oh, outside. Well, that's kind of what you expect in an 0-2 count. Excellent job of the hitter to I have the plate discipline to lay off of that pitch. Ooh, this I got one it. popped up. Foul me, ground me, me, me. I got it, Matt Castle. And Vasquez is gone. Two up, two down. That wasn't Matt that Castle. Was the first baseman, Bobby Dahlbeck. Here's Bobby Dahlbeck. This is another guy capable of Hitting tape measure down, home man. runs. In there, there and it's on one. Easy out, easy out. Plays it first. Woo! Swing and a miss. With that cutter, they baby. can live up in the zone all game Bobby if guys will chase it. That's down. just too much velocity. Hitters got to look down in the zone. Here we go in the one, two, three. Oh, the next pitch misses, down. and it's one and two. Sit down, Bobby. Next offering is fouled back. All right, we're going to get it with the vocal change, I think, because I feel like the vocal change is... The wind of the pitch. Five. That two misses ball. the zone, and the count's even at two. Yeah, with the slider, maybe? And that's the third out. Red Sox go down quietly. We'll go to the Woo! bottom of the second. No score. New inning getting started. Here's Kike Hernandez. Leading off for the Red Sox. The center fielder, number five. Kike the kid back to Hernandez. work. That one's in there. 0-1. One, one. What? I'm... Ain't nobody judging me. I think it's pronounced Enrique. Next offering is fouled back. Not Enrique. <laughs> Sit down, Enrique. Next one in one the one dirt. Two. Here we go. And with the book will change, let's see if we can't get him staring. Lifted in the air, right center Come field. Come on, Cedric. Mullen sizes this one up. Can't get there. Base hit. Him. And that's a leadoff double. Good two-strike hitting right there, Boog. A bit of a lost art for that some, so that was nicely done to beat the odds. Put a really nice balanced yeah. swing on it, and when you can rope one into the gap like that, you're thinking extra bases from the first couple of steps out of the box. And He'll feel Nobody real good about that shit. one. Runner in scoring position now and a good hey. opportunity to push Ooh, across the first run of the bucket. Johan Miesis Johan. takes a strike there Get as a strike he stands at the plate now. Johan. Top of the third, no score. Johan. 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 Next offering is down low. Bro. Hitter's got some good opposite Man, field right power. Now. What I like about something being hit to the right side oh, into the right outfield down. is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. Oh, that's off the plate. Next Are pitch misses outside. Right now? Three and one now. Righty to the plate. There right he side. Is. Odor I'll take reversed. It. And one away in the top of the third. Ooh, see if I can't get out this jam here. That's a boy Odor, even though you don't play for us no more. 
Let's go, let's go. At the play, Trevor Story. He's 0 for 1. Bounced up the middle. Urias handles the chance. Whips it to first. There for the out. Runner scores from third. Well, there it is, a little old school manufacturing okay. of a run after that double. Ground out to get him over and another ground out to get him in. Nice job to get that RBI. And next for the Red Sox, Alex Verdugo. Good contact guy, good defender. That one's in there, 0 and 1. Left hand batter waits. Pitch misses. And one Are you and one. Fucking serious? It's, one. it's a good miss. Come on, boys. One, we one. need to score in the bottom of the third here. Ball and through. downstairs. Count is two and one. Two down, two down. Two outs. That what? misses the zone, and now three and one. What? A rare three ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. Sit down, please, my boy. Up the middle, Odor gloves it. Oh, Odor trying to be and like the old is set down. Third out, man. that ends the frame. We done. head down to the home half of inning number three. It's the Red Sox oh, one Lord. and the Orioles nothing. Please, someone score. Back here at the ballpark. And Nobody here comes Sander Bogarts. Leading off with the Red Sox. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. Side. This guy checks all Sander. the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon, the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership that he shows on and off the field. That's a base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Mm. Not a start that I was hoping now for. Man aboard, and, and here is Devers. A double play would be nice. First pitch, well, not close. And no outs here. Right hander kicks deals. Ball two. Just Are you miss. Flipping serious? Oh, he looks more focused at the plate and working the count after that first at bat strikeout. Turn it. Come on now. Get a ground out, you little bitch. Next offering is foul back. I'm begging you to get a ground out. Two one pitches in there, and the count is even. Left Swing hand hitter waits, boy. and a foul ball. He stays alive. Ah 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 ah! Staying alive, staying alive. He back to the pitch. Sit back down. On the ground, right side. Ow! This looks like extra bases. How the hell you messed that up, Odor? Here comes Bogarts around third. The relay, safe at the plate. And they lead by two. Damn it! Gotta love the resiliency he showed in that at bat, battling with two strikes. Absolutely smoked that baseball. What a swing. Sent it out way faster than it How came in, of course. That, 113 off the bat, and no matter where you hit it at that speed, it's tough to make a play on. And now J.D. Martinez ah, in the air, left side. Hayes oh, under geez. this one. Makes the catch for the out. And thank God for Austin. Now that catch it. Lord, I mercy. Can that boy say a score? Jesus Christ. Here's Christian Vasquez. That's all I'm asking for three runs. First Count offering misses old. badly for ball one. Yeah, and a swing and a miss. A ball, one Spin rate's outstanding down, on that high fastball. Really tough to hit. Whoa. Strike two. Two strikes. One out and a runner at second. Sit down, homeboy. Next nope. pitch misses, and it's two and two. Line drive. Nice Come on. Chance by Odor. You can't sell, but you can't get the other one. Now battle. 
the first baseman. You let the other one go. Dahlbeck. Bobby Dahlbeck up next for the Red Sox. And Boog, I'd say he's due. Hey, come on now. Lord have mercy. Pitch misses oh, inside. Please, and that's ball scoring. one. Ah. And he pumps nice. in a strike. Well, I know they've gotten out to an early lead, but you don't want to take these opportunities for granted. With two outs, still lock in with a quality at bat, drive in that run. You may not have oh, another guy in scoring geez. position the rest of this ballgame. Hayes, gliding to his right, pulls it down, and he makes the catch. And that will end the inning. So they pick up a run on two hits, no so errors, and a man scored. left. To Not the bottom there. of inning number four now. It's the Red Sox two, and the Orioles nothing. Back now at Oriole Park, ready see. now for the fifth inning. Digging we in, Enrique Sox, Hernandez. The center fielder, number five, Kike the right-hander back to work. And a good fastball to start him off at strike one. Kicks and fires. Ball. Oh, you what? One ball, one strike. Ball. Good eye right oh there. God. Looks like he's being a little cautious with him in this at bat after doubling the first time up. Doesn't want to make another mistake. The pitch. Just it's missed. Ball three. Is there a little what? wrinkle to that? I think go. there was. Yeah. A little slider action. Three two now. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. Sit down, my boy. Thanks for coming. Bounce to the left side. Nice. Thank you. Tosses the oh. first, one up, one down. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out the of the air, lets Number the defense three. work behind him with another Your ground mind. ball. Good execution. Yeah. Well, it doesn't help. And now the, the right fielder, Johan Mieses. He's got pop, which is a little sneaky because he's so comfortable with taking his base hits to the opposite field. But he can jump you if you make a mistake. Next offering is foul back. And the righty deals. Flew open a little bit with that front shoulder, but was able to slow his back down just enough mm -hmm. to make contact with that pitch. Keep the bat alive. And a foul ball. He went chasing for that. The 0-2. That one drifts oh, inside. Oh my God! Are you kidding me? This ref is freaking high in the air, out to right. Santander drifts Atta towards boy, it. Snaps it for the second out. Woo! I believe this is going to be my last the inning for the night. Second base, Trevor Story. Here's Trevor but Story. It, de it depends he on how he is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. Hey. And that's in there for strike one. I think he was sitting off speed right there because he just let the fastball go by. Whoa, Next offering so misses, and it's one and one. He really committed to that fastball up at the top of the zone. He knows that if he makes a mistake in the zone, it gets hit hard hey. by a power guy like this. That's a nice miss Down. right there. One and two. The pitch stays alive. You know that broken chain down over there in the quarter. Next pitch is oh, outside. Two well, down, the nobody on. The inning. Got it. Got it. And good work there as he Not gets enough. a one, Not two, enough. three. Nothing doing for Boston. Now let's get some but they're on top, boys. two nothing. Ready reliever out of the pen, Tommy Wilson. On for his 20th appearance of the year. 
Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. All right, please, so I get the win. After four Thank wins you. in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll. And that's the I'm momentum win, win, that just win, takes no on a life of its own. Guys start Nobody hitting up and down the lineup. You never know who's going to come up with the big hit, who's going to come out of the bullpen and get the big outs. But it's a good feeling, and you want to extend it. This one finishes with a final of 7-4. to four. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Chompy saying so long. Our final line score Okay. Tonight. Wow, Dylan Tate got the win. Seven runs on 14 hits. No errors. They left 16 men on base. For the Red Sox, four runs on eight hits. One error. They left two men on base. That's not too bad. Five innings, four strikeouts. And 30 minutes. Or five, my bad. Five innings, four hits, five strikeouts, zero walks. And we remind you to please drive home. Where did where did that come from? Bottom of the eighth inning. Thank you, Dylan Tate. Yeah, as long as as long as Dylan Tate got the win for us, I'm happy. I don't know what pitches to change up, but we're about to change it up here after this episode. Ooh wee! What a good game that must have been. I mean, well, I take the win though. Seven to four. September 9th is a special day across Major League Baseball when we celebrate the life and career of the great Roberto Clemente. Al Leiter is here, and Al, you're a winner of the Clemente Award for your work both on and off the field. What did winning that award mean to you? I, it's it's the best baseball award I ever got as an individual. I I, I was lucky enough to have been on some world championship teams, but you know. I, I wasn't good enough to win a Cy Young. I, and I just think it represents what Roberto Clemente was and who he was as a person. And it, we're more than just baseball players. I, I always yeah. felt that way, uh, especially as a starting pitcher. I know I had some latitude to be able to do some community service things for the club and in the community and, uh, you know, just to help out. And I, and I always thought that when you have a chance to help others, any time when it wasn't a distraction with the guys that are playing or when your game days are, um, it's something that I'll never forget. And I think well-deserving, I'm glad baseball is doing this uh, with respect to honoring Roberto Clemente. That's well said, Al. Thanks. And on that note, we're going to check the standings out here. We might be able to make the playoffs. I have no idea. 13 games back. Seven and a half back out of the wild card. We got we gotta do some winning. We gotta do some winning. But on that note guys, I'll see you in the next one. Hope you have a good day and peace out.